Hey guys, this is Crap Hunter, and welcome back to Shogun 2! Woo! <clears throat> yes, this is Shogun 2, and uh, we're doing pretty well at the moment. I don't know whether this will be the second before last episode, or the last episode, so I'm going to treat it like the last episode, so in case I can't upload everything in time, uh, this is the last episode, or hopefully not. Hopefully we can get one more episode in before we have to go. But anyway, um, more importantly, what has been going on? Well, the good news is we finished the campaign. Huzzah! Yes, we have finally finished the campaign. So pretty much what we're doing now is cleanup duty. Um, we have completely com sorted out everything. But because we've still got some time left before the big move, I am going to be... Uh... Yes, ah, yes, I remember buddy. that. <clears throat> before the big move, we are going to be seeing the end of, hopefully the Obama clan, which will be fantastic. We've also got ourselves a new I army, which his loyalty is actually fairly decent. Um, I might make him something if I have sp spare room for something. Um, but yeah, Obama's making a bit of a, a, a dangerous gambit. Um, they are the most modern, though, of armies. Whereas over here, on the front, uh, everyone around them has got either very poor ranged units or no ranged units at all. Uh, making a bit of a dangerous push for myself here. <clears throat> Sorry. Putting the dangerous push for myself here, going for Hitachi whilst in the middle of winter. Stupid, I know, but what can you do? Um, sabotage army. Oh, that could be a wise endeavor. Don't die. Yes! Hoorah. Good. That means I can attack. And he becomes a better spy as well. How cool is that? Right. What are your retainers? Philadelphia. What's that? Killing an agent in self-defense, or I'll have that. Um, yeah, I think sabotage will be good because then that way you can also be better at sabotage. Cool. So, alrighty then. So, without further ado, next turn. So, what I'm going to be doing now, um, at least for a few, is definitely try and push up and reclaim a number of territories. Definitely going to try that. Um, as to how much, not too sure, but if we can finish off the war against the Nagoka, um, if Obama goes down, that'll be like the bare minimum objective. I mean, Obama's being incredibly dickish at the moment, but I'm hoping the Sioux clan can actually move up and take over that settlement. Reached. Yes! I think they've just taken that region as well. Um, Perhaps, if you listen to my offer, you will find some merit in the idea. That doesn't really seem fair. If they want military access, uh, we demand a payment then of, uh, I'd say, 1,500. Your words lack substance, and I will risk. Well, you're not just going to say, yo, give us it military access, are they? Right, okay, they're going to be trying something a little cocky. Now, the Goka clan have decided to become surprisingly aggressive. Um, Hiroshima are now doing something pretty nice. I think we've just seen the end of the Obama clan, which is brilliant. Um, and apparently my Okazai uh, dude can act is uh, going a bit batshit crazy. So, we've definitely got control over Yamashiro, which is brilliant. Unfortunately... So have they. Um. Playing them ambush, my lord. Ooh, Sunpoo. Okay, we're now at war with Sunpoo. Uh, tactical withdrawal. Uh, enemy raid. Awa Shanobi detected. Awa Shanobi detected. That guy is still suffering. And, yep. Obama is now destroyed. Huzzah. So now. Uh, unfortunately, we have suffered some winter attrition, what which is you wish to, be a, to be frustrated and frowned upon, but, you know, oh well. Shame they couldn't fix this. Oh, shame they couldn't fix Sue Turner had to come after that. But the good news is, here, now can actually send some reinforcements, and I am just going to send some reinforcements, uh, including the general, and that, over to Karga. You guys. What is your bidding? Who's the weakest? What Who's the lowest of levels? Do, my lord? Okay, I think as you're the, the lowest emperor. of levels, you're going to watch over Ichigan. Um, you, I think we're going to be sending to the fronts Yazoo, 
that piece, that piece, that piece. Okay, so they're not really, there's no real th front to have to worry about, is it? <clears throat> Except for the Miyazu front, which is like next to two, so I'm all good. You guys can actually push up. Come on, a piece. I'm going to send you guys as well. I nope, no, that, well that way. What do that you was so stupid. You? Right, that way. Making my way. Boarding the train, my lord. My lord? That's just a thought. Setting forth, no, you can't. Lord. You can't. You actually have to take the road. For Sucks. The Emperor. Right, you. I'm going to send you on the train. Boarding a train, my lord. Yeah, one one line infantry. Ooh, parrot guns. We're going to need to send those guys off as well. Uh, yep. What would you have me Okay, do? cool. We've got that sorted. Tusiana. Uh... A new clan, apparently. Cool. Construction report. Military Port Mumashi is successful, which they are now rather close to getting. I am somewhat concerned. But once again, they're mainly melee based, so there isn't any real problem, is there? Um, Nagoka clan are making a push, but it is winter still. And we have unfortunately suffered some winter attrition. So we haven't. We, are get, we can't get away with it all. But. Ready for orders. What I am hoping to do... We're going to have to attack this navy, aren't we? He's going to withdraw. I mean, hell, shit tons of ships versus his. He's going to bugger off, isn't he? No, he's not! And that's why. Right, okay. This is good. This means that the enemy ships could sink and we could completely destroy them. So, what I'm going to do... Save here, because I don't think I've saved in a while. And we will see you on the field. And we're back. And we are certainly going to be crossing Hit My T. Yep. Standard shells. I think will probably be the day. Yeah, Kayu Maru class. Kayu Maru class. And one copper plated Kayu Maru. You, you, and you. Actually, we're going to group you because it makes a lot more sense, doesn't it? Right. How many ships send you that way? You because you're bigger that way. You because you're bigger that way. So you will be ship group one. And you will follow in exact lineup like so. Huzzah. It's a lot of ships. Uh, you'll be group number two. Following in the exact same route as number one. This will be interesting. Okay. The men are ready to attack, sir. Right, okay, so he's already tried to cross hit RT, and he's failed to do so. So, there's that, that that one. And you will do the exact same thing, and cross his T. So, fingers crossed this works out. I don't exactly know whether it will or not. But, really, it's all about who gets there first, and who actually gets to do stuff. We do have an enemy fleet on the horizon. I'm not entirely sure where they'll come from, um, but I'm only going to assume that they will inevitably show up. There is only but one ship. And ironically enough, this is the most advanced form of warfare. Aha! Right, there are the enemy ships. A little bit different to where I'd think they would be, but apparently they've suffered some pretty nasty damage, and I can already see that beating them will probably be a lot. Right, okay, so what we need to do then is kind of get into position. Risk being shot at by him, but at the same time, move into position to engage. I don't exactly know whether that's going to work or not. How does it work? I was going to say, it's not like they've actually changed their minds. There you go. For you, I want you to be there. Try and race them to it if you can. There you go. <clears throat> They've taken a hell of a pummeling. It's amazing that they're still up. And they're stuck as well. Yes, they are actually stuck. This is good. This is brilliant. Jeez, they've taken the most... Ironically enough, this thing, which might be the general... I don't know, is it the general? No, the enemy general... Well, the enemy general's over there who's commanding it, but I'm assuming he's the one. He's the best armed, and I, luckily enough, he's also the one who can't use his guns the most, or at least his guns are all completely the wrong way. Another really beneficial thing about sinking this fleet, 
speed things up because I can imagine how bored you guys must be about now. There we go. Um, another beneficial thing about this is the fact that they're also transporting a huge, huge army. Um, which, on one hand, will give them a crap ton of money and resources to utilize, but at the same time, it'll also mean that he will have a very reduced amount of troops. He'll, it'll take a very... It's a serious blow, regardless of how much money he makes. Right. Is he making... He's apparently making a move. I am curious. Let's see what you're doing. Well, he's making a push. You engage those guys. You... They're making their way, but it's very slow pace. Be nice to get them to speed up a little bit. But that said, we've also got a ridiculous amount of gunpowder. I think we will be slightly crossed. So, swing around a bit. Okay, they're reacting. But reacting in the completely the wrong way. Rapid fire. Royal Navy! Look at the size of this ship! <laughs> this is gonna be glorious. Oh, I'm hearing the shells already. Nice, 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 nice. Under heavy fire. Right, you guys already under fire, having your T's crossed. Right, you're taking a bit of fire now. Taking a bit of damage, but because you're an iron class, you're actually alright. Your general is under attack, sir! Yeah, yeah, we know. You in range? No, I don't think you are. No, you are. You are in range. Where are you? Right. You guys. You. Kill. You. Move over. Kill. You. I want you to actually go off and engage that guy. You. I want you to go off and engage that guy. Group disband. Group disband. The whole point of the groups was that they were supposed to. Right. You. There. You. You. Same target. You, same target. You need you to help up along this side. Anyone else good? No. Okay, you guys are taking fire. You guys are doing pretty well. I think I finally may have gotten a grip and control of this thing. Just in case. You, just in case. Yeah. Up, up there and start engaging that guy. We're already sending one of them to retreat. That's great. I need you to do something. We're hammering these bastards. It's glorious. They can't react as well, which is just gloriously even better. Um, Kasuga class is being hammered to shit, which is good. Enemy ship is holding his own, which is nice. Who's taking the damage? Oh, he has. Well, I'm not surprised. He's being a bit of a dumbass about it. Five guns lost. Really? Y you're that shit? God damn it. Right, okay, cool. Right, that guy's withdrawing, which is a small mercy. Why off right. Engage that guy. Hammer him to shit. You. Feuer frei. For the target. You, I want you to try and swing around and cut that guy's leg off. Oh, there's a two to escape. Your general is in terrible danger. It's alright. Where's my armor? There's my armor. He's not a heavy fire. Yeah, that guy's getting his ass handed to. That guy's taking a punch. You swing around and engage. 
three. Dude, that guy's completely screwed. It's ridiculous. It's embarrassing. Hey, it's a little gunboat. Right, you're engaging him. He's crossing the T's. Oh my Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Holy crap. You have taken a shit ton. But then again, you're not actually that badly damaged. Rapid fire. Do you not see the bad guy over there? You've had your maneuverability cut down, that's for damn sure. Ow. I fear your general is in mortal peril, sir. Yeah, he is somewhat buggered, I will not deny that, but he's not completely in moral peril yet. Or mortal peril. Or whatever. Swing round, engage. Have we sunk the other dude yet? I'm going to assume that yes. I'm gonna assume yes. Okay, one of those dudes has already surrendered. Yep. Finally mastered the ocean. Generally speaking, when you can master the ocean in games like Napoleon or Empire, you've generally won the game. Um, unless you're, you're terrible at melee in ground forces. Because although it takes ground forces to win the war, controlling the sea as well, especially in games like Japan, especially in Empire, more in... Napoleon, I don't know if it's as important in in Shogun. I mean, as you are one landmass, it doesn't really matter. Um, but it certainly does affect how your successful your war will be against someone if you can knock them out of the ocean. Your general is under attack, sir. I mean, I say this because although to a certain extent you may be reliant on trade, which then can cause you to completely collapse. At the same time, um, given your preparedness for it. I've survived being having my having all of my ports blocked, and no nothing really was nothing really was wrong with it. Right, you focus on those guys. Why are you routing? It is just typical. It's just typical total war stuff. It's like we're winning. Run! <laughs> Unless my um, asshole of a general is saying. No, it does look a little better without the, the sail. Yeah, you look badass. I mean, you know, God help you if you ever have any sort of navy stuff, but still. But still. I think we're about to get them. They are, we, they are withdrawing, but we have complete... Hopefully we can completely cut off their retreat. Preferably we can get them before... Right, you... Oh, it's sinking. Apparently it's sinking. Be nice if it was. Apparently so is that one. We're hammering the bastard, so hopefully... It'll be nice if they sank. Swing around. You. Engage. You. Uh, I think engage that one first. So you. Engage that. You. Engage you. Engage... Oh no, who's that? Oh, it's the enemy. Phew, I thought it was one of my own. I was like, no! A priceless battle lost. Oh, it's sunk. I think it's sunk. Yes, it's sunk. Right, okay. Everybody on him. That's quite a dickish move, I realize, but sod it. Oh. Yeah, gone. He is gone, he's sunk, he is completely gone. Well, that's awesome. So, we'll see you guys back in the campaign map. So, victory is ours. And, yep, there goes that one fleet. And, unfortunately, the other fleet decides to bugger off. But we will be pursuing them. That's for damn sure. Right, move up. We will capture and knock out... There you are. Oh, God, this is brilliant. What's this? 
must be complete. Yeah, look at that. The shell, the superstructure is completely destroyed. How awesome is this? Right. Hmm, that is a threat, though. But that said, it's not the end of the world if someone... My lord. Right, okay. I'm going to say I can sabotage army. Is there any shogunat? But we will ins we will scare the living crap out of these people. What do you wish of me? Oh Persuade the troops. France. Will it work? Oh, huzzah! We fight for the emperor. <laughs> no, you don't. We go with honor. <laughs> <laughs> no, you what don't. Right. Um, I could be really dickish and say, oh, I'm going to take that army as well. But what I will do is I will just sabo that. Booyah! Right, so now he can't move at all, which is brilliant. Over here, once again, we're going to deliver the final killing blow to the enemy army on the navy. You really shouldn't have done that. In fact, I might just be tempted to skip battle. So it will skip battle. So the enemy ships were lost. And that is the day. Um, enemy fleet completely sunk. We have taken some serious damage, so I will be sending my guys back to the military port to fix up, because they have taken a bit of a beating. And now we are completely... B bugger. Oh, what is it, Stronghold? Oh, we don't need all those cannons. We're fine. <laughs> right. Cool. Um, okay, well... Can't save you now, can you? We've got cannon. Oh wow, even the camo's, uh, cannon's got camo. <laughs> so yeah, we outnumber them quite severely, and uh, you know what? Screw it, I'm half tempted not to bother. No, we would do it. Might as well go for it. So, see you in the game. And we're back, and we are in very fortuitous scenario. Don't need the uh, whole navy to do this, so because we've got armor strong guns, we're fine. Um. Sendai don't really pack too much of a punch at the moment, which is a bit of a shame, because I kind of wanted to have a little bit more of a challenge. But it, it's always the way, isn't it? You get, you, you spend half, if not most, of the game. Right, we're actually going to make the Royal Marines do something for a change. So, Empire line infantry will watch the cannon. Sabers will be watching that line, and my general will be over here. Go. Gambata! Right, ceasefire. You will target. Paul! Be accurate. Right, Gambata, so you're going to be able to do something to it. And. Did I just tell them to. Um, yeah, I just told them to limber up. Because I'm a twat. To do that. Well, it didn't stop them from firing. I just. Wish I had the tactical sense and now to not suck that much. Okay, well, you know, they'll get like a first volley off. The whole point is the whole, the whole first point is just to knock this wall out, whether they have accuracy or not. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You can start firing. Oh, you're about to lose it. Hoya! There we go. Oh! Oh, there you go. Totally not what I told you to shoot at, but whatever. And now the wall's less occupied. Great. Oh, wait, no, there are still people occupying it. Oh, Jesus Christ, one burst. Nice, nice. Uh, that fort wall. This is just glorious. I love it. Oh, actually, are we too far? No, we, we're in position. We're in a good position. Because the whole point is, we're just going to try and knock the walls out, so they can't really, they can't really um, provide any heavy suppressor fire. I will completely nuke this wall. I know it's a bad idea because it'll mean I'll have to pay a lot to fix it, but. It'll be another territory. I have enough cash. I make enough. Hey, there goes another band of bad guys. 
Right, so they're gone, which is brilliant. Uh, target that. Nice, nice, nice. I like the fact that you're targeting the wall behind them as well. It's like, yeah, sure, we'll go for that. Right, so now... Schabschütze. Go to the river's edge. And target. Infantry probably have gone flying. Yes, they have. Those guys. Can I be cheeky? And... Yes! I was just about to ask you to shoot that. You're like a mind reader. Yeah, that car is completely nuked. Try this side as well. Nice. Shoot this section of the wall. More of them are being pulverized. This is good. Only downside, of course, I haven't got any melee infantry, so when it comes to the actual big one, we may have trouble. Right. Try and target this, but I don't expect much. Right, Sharpshitzer, how you doing? You, you're taking your time, but it doesn't matter. Right. The real threat, of course, will be this bit. These two guys here, the... the I mean, I'll, I'll use my artillery support as much as I can, but I'm um, definitely going to try and see if we can do something. Meanwhile, let's organize into a battle formation, so obviously they're not going to be able to shoot at us now. So, infantry will march across. I think there's a shallow nearby, but this is the proper river, so we'll probably have to take this entrance, which could be threatening because they are very exposed there, but at the moment, I don't think we've got any range. I don't think they have the range to do it. Here is where you want to move them up to, fair enough. I love how the Emperor, like the people who are native to this country, suffer attrition in the winter, yet our guys, no attrition at all. <laughs> right, you guys, moving up. Cavalry. 